Jennifer Nettles is one of our favorites. She's not only a Grammy-winning musician, she's also an actress who's taken on movies, television, mm -hmm. and Broadway. Well, guess, get this. Jennifer is now heading back to the small screen. She's hosting one of this, gr this great dating series that Jen and I have been obsessed mm -hmm. with. It's called Farmer Wants a Wife. She's helping four <laughs> country guys in their search for true love. Take a look. Congratulations. This is a big day. And for some of you, this may be a life-changing moment. For some of you, this may be the moment that you meet your partner for your life. Waiting right outside are your four <laughs> farmers. So let's bring them in. Please welcome Farmer Hunter. We totally get Jennifer, it. We're sold. We've been talking about this show. We didn't know you were hosting it, and now it's even better yes, than we thought. It, it's so, so fun. What drew you? What? Why did you decide to say yes to this one? It took me a minute. Yeah, to I was going to say. Like, I'm not one. I don't. I'm not a fan necessarily of the reality dating genre. Mm -hmm. I don't. I don't. <laughs> well I like said. that you called it a genre. Genre. Yeah. Should we say? Yes. Yeah. I, I, I don't really get into that. So at first I was like, mm, I don't know about a dating show, and then. Um, then they, they told me the premise, and I thought, oh, and they also told me the success of the show. And I don't mean in terms of ratings. I mean in terms of couples. Tell us. Wait, tell, tell us. us about the success because it's actually it's wild. It's wild. So, so this show has been all over the world. And out of it so far, there have resulted over 180 marriages and over 410 children. So every marriage is having four kids about. <laughs> wow. When Hoda right? and I heard the, when the kid, you're really So good. it's really working. When we heard wow. the kid number, we were like, whoa. whoa. I know. So, it's significant. So is it city girls and farmers? Is that kind of the that's premise? Most, yeah, that's most of the gist, uh, uh, and mostly city girls, mm -hmm. you know, with these farmers. Because the question becomes then, what would you do for love? What would you change your life? And these people, they get to ask actually all the right questions that most of us probably don't ask. Like meet what? In the conventional way. Like, yeah. okay, wait, do I want to change my life? And yeah. What yeah. is this connection? And am I feeling this connection yeah. in the same way? Yeah. And when I learned what, like, the authenticity of the show mm -hmm. and how authentic it yeah. was, I was like, oh, I can, d I love, I love a good story and I love a good love story. Yeah. Yes. So I would, yeah, I love getting to be a part of their love story. Um, we, we know that you have um, a, a boyfriend or um, a, a a mm -hmm. boyfriend, right? So you're not looking for love, but would you think um, reality dating would ever be up your alley? No, never. <laughs> never, ever, ever would I. No, I, it's not. I'm too private for that. You Plus, I think it would be so unnerving. I don't know how they do it. I'm looking over there at them right now. They're smiling. I don't know how they do it. Oh, look, we've got your farmers here. here. Yeah, we're going to have them coming up in our next segment. Yeah. We want to talk to you about uh, something else, too. So you live in New York, which is super cool, and yeah. you have a, an adorable son. I do. What's it, a lot of people ask us yeah. this question, too. What's it like? like raising kids in New York City. People's like, how do you do it? Where do you go? How do you make it work? It's amazing yeah. because anything that they're interested in and that they love, you can find here. Totally. Like we just went to the Met on Saturday because right now he's very much into Egypt. He's very much into origin stories mm -hmm. and like creation myths, cosmology and end of the world and religion. He's very much into that. So we went there and he had a ball and he's just now getting to the age because he's 10. He's just now getting to the age where you know, he can go and read some of the things yeah. and really be interested in it in a deeper way. So I, it's a blast. I, I feel like Manhattan is that kind of a place because yes. they say like there's someone from every religion, every culture, and we live in this one mile kind of island. And if Manhattan can work, then the world can work. Yeah. It's like because you're around everybody. Sure. Yes. Absolutely. Yeah. And that's another part of it, too, is just the diversity, the learning how to coexist in yeah. small spaces. If you yeah. can coexist yeah. on the subway, you can definitely coexist <laughs> totally. in the world. And the rest of the world. Yeah. Okay, wait, we love you as a for me. Music, yeah. but we just read that you're going to be in The Exorcist. I Wait, know. What are you doing? Wait. What role? What are you doing? I can't say. Oh. I can't say. I and will you say like it's a major scary role. movies? It's a role. No. That's it. No. <laughs> I don't. I can't see them, but I can be in them. Very different. Have things. you shot it yet, or are you about to? Yeah. You've yeah. already shot it? Yeah. <gasps> Was it terrifying? It was intense. Do you know how it to scream? Was What's your scream? I'm not a good screamer. 
Mm. Did you have to learn? And I had to do a little bit, a little bit. Mostly it was just like freaking, Do you like how we're trying to dig? Freaking out, yeah, freaking out, crying, yeah, freaking out. What about, yeah. what about music, new music? New music. I just finished an album uh, with a friend of mine, a Latin artist named Noel Chacris. We mm. did uh, an album of Spanish and English songs. Very classic, very timeless, um, really, really singer-songwriter oriented. You're just cool. Gosh, we just love cool. you. I just have to keep, you know, mixing it up. It's yeah, so that, cool. that's the best part. That's the best part of you. You're such an artist. Okay, do not go anywhere because we have wrangled up the four hunky farmers. They're all searching for love. Uh -huh. <laughs> They're going to hang out with us right after this. Farmer Ryan, you look wonderful. You look so handsome. How are you feeling? I tell people that cowboying makes up half of who I am. And my horses mean everything to me, you know. So to open myself up and share that part of my life with someone, um, <clears throat> it would mean a lot. Aww, that's me. Which one is your... Oh, oh my God. <laughs> Shannon and I are like, pick me. All right, that is a sneak peek from the new reality dating show. It's called Farmer Wants a Wife, already one of the most successful shows around the world, dating shows. It airs in 32 countries, and we're going to say this again. It result, resulted in 180 marriages and 410 children. We still can't get over no, the amount of children. Y'all yeah, yeah, better prepare yourself. Yeah. <laughs> Jennifer Nettles is the host, and he, with us are the four. I can't get over the amount of children <laughs> we're, either. We're stuck in it. Here are the four farmers. We have Landon Heaton, Ryan Black. Hunter Grayson and Alan Foster. Y'all, good morning. Good morning. Thank you guys for having us. So to start off, Landon, are y'all, are you happy that you went on this show? Was it a good experience? It was a good that? experience. Yeah? I mean, you know, I, I've never watched reality TV before and I, I had no clue what to expect going into this. I was pretty pessimistic about it, but honestly, it was... I'm very grateful for the opportunity and the experience. So. This is probably not like the traditional way, go no. to the bar yeah. or yeah. online dating to meet love. What made you think, like, okay, let's try yeah. this? Well, you know, I would say that if we were good at dating eight girls at one time, nobody would like us, right? <laughs> <laughs> but, you know, we wanted to be open about it, and I think we all came into it with an open mind. And, um, you know, I like to say that there was moral obligations behind it for me as well. Um, to shed light on, I'm a third generation cowboy, so yeah. to shed light on what my grandfather fought and built and um, others around, mm -hmm. you know, and I think we all have our own, you know, good, solid reasons for yeah. it coming uh, about. Uh, there's this, this has, a, the show, Hunter, has a feeling of like opposites attracting, you know, someone who's from the city and so, did you find that and did you believe opposites attract or do you think you have to have more in common? You know, I think there's that healthy balance of yeah. having enough in common to where you enjoy a lot of similar yeah. things and... But at the same time, you can't fill a cup that's already full. Yeah. So, you know, you got to find that person that has enough growth that you can grow with as well and y'all grow together because that's what's going to make a relationship stand the test well, of time. But y'all are so profound. Why are you so deep? <laughs> uh, y'all have a farmer. Wait, I'm serious. <laughs> Alan, okay. You do, got that? Alan, 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 it's your turn. Alan, I'm going to get to you. But first, do any of y'all have a farmer for Hoda? <laughs> yeah. Can we find a hard farmer for Hoda anymore? Yeah, yeah. Alan, that's going to be Alan, one of your jobs. <laughs> Alan, that, you, you're on. Yeah. Okay, but also, right. do you feel like you could have ever traded places and like moved to the big city? Are you your home is is uh, on you a know, farm? The short on answer ranch. to that is absolutely not. You know, like I, I like jo <laughs> and, <laughs> I enjoy coming to the city and yeah. visiting and and seeing. You know how the rest of the world lives, <laughs> but, but you know that's not that's not where my heart is. That's not how I grew up, and it's not it's not somewhere I see myself really. Yeah. What were some of the challenges that the women had, you guys? What did you sense? I would like to say. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah. where uh, do we start? I know there were yeah. some times that we had to. Uh, Cut some bulls to make some steers, and I had to inform the ladies that we were. Uh, Wait, what? I some... took them on the farm to show them farm life. If you don't know what Wait, you're getting cut into, cut some bulls, bulls to make, make some, some steers. steers. Right, cut the low-hanging fruit. Oh, just, just Google it. <laughs> we thought the 410 okay. kids was okay. weird. Okay, <laughs> all right. So they had to witness that. Oh, they took part. Participate. Oh, jeez. Yes, oh. ma'am. It's real work. Real. So life. you had to pass that test before you uh, could. Make the cut? Qualified. You know, for me, it <laughs> no was like... Intended. <laughs> <laughs> we're not looking for business partners. We're looking for partners for, in life. So yeah. they just got to be willing to do what well, we're doing. Well, come on. Okay. We, we want to learn a little bit about farm life. Yeah. Let's go. 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 Let's go.
Okay. Just come over. Come watch. Okay, so we're going to be doing some lassoing. Yes, ma'am. Are those the lassos? Yes, ma'am. Okay, will you show us what we're yeah, supposed to do? Show uh, come on. All right. <laughs> yeah, we, we do need to turn those around. <laughs> oh, they're pointed the, the wrong way? From the front. <laughs> By the way, I'm from Texas, but that does not mean I know how to do this. Okay? Well, that's, that's not what you said in the break. No, you said I, that I can not do true. it. I said I you're going to be good. I sleep. Here you go. This is mine? Yes, ma'am. Okay, so. Yo, I'm sure. Where's the circle part? No, we didn't bring those. We didn't bring those. So we don't. Yeah. So we not? we're going to get the bad rope? Yeah, okay, go ahead. Let's so, see. I mean, you just build your Wait. loop out. Oh, gosh. Wait. Stand back. What's happening here? We don't want to get hit. <laughs> oh, yeah. Look out for our lights. The lights, the lights are lights. Spin, not a lot of clear. May, uh, not a lot of clear. Back, back up. Okay, yeah, oh, we God. don't want to get just hit. a smidge. No pressure, guys. Well, fire away. <laughs> I'll miss second. Oh, you'll miss second. Nice. Yeah! yeah. We're talking about it. We are. No pressure. No pressure. She's... <laughs> Like, whoa. Wow. Okay, so now what? Again, we throw up the farmer for Hoda. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so, so what do you do? Do you build I'm scared. You want to use it? I think Hoda should just do it. Oh, no, these well, how do you do it? With this thing? Oh, no, you don't want these, do right? Do we don't want these. So when, we, when I found out we were doing it, the first thing I packed in my bag was my rope. Okay, okay, so you can throw the rope. So you got to just okay. get your okay. a little bigger. And get her a good this rope. Yeah, Let me get this. I don't want that crummy one. Okay, so what am I doing? Hold that about right there. No, I don't think I can, but Hoda can, because Hoda played basketball. You grew up in Texas. Wait, I'm going to do it. You know I'm going to do it. So wait, how do you one wrist? Just roll your wrist. You there we go. It. You <laughs> it. Oh no! Oh you, uh, no! Get ready to go! No! Give it to me! Give it to me! Give it to me. Okay. I'm just I gonna say she just wrote the prettiest thing in the room, so we got. <laughs> Okay, hold on. Let me just get it. You, will you get it? Catch y'all twisted. There okay. we go. Okay. It's not easy, by the not, way. Can I just throw it? Yes, on yes it? Ma'am. Absolutely. 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 Okay, throw it, Oda. You got it. Think basketball. Oh. Oh. One, more, one, more, one, more, one more time. One more, one more, one more. One more, one more, one more. You gotta go. We're running out of time. It's okay. We're the other <laughs> Hurry, segments. You can Hurry, do Lynn. it. Last one, last one. Last one, last one. I'm gonna do it. Oh, big. Closer. Yep. Go, Oda. You got it. You set it on there. Oh, there we go. Anyway, I love y'all. Y'all are amazing. Y'all are awesome. Thank you. Congratulations. Thank you. 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 Farmer Wants a Wife premieres this Wednesday night. Can't wait to watch.